that people not be forgotten. Um, there was a woman I met briefly, her name was Janice Baker, and she was very active in local democratic politics. And um, so I won't go through the whole story, but um, it was largely due to her that I got involved in doing home banking and lots of stuff for local candidates. I hadn't done it in a while. And anyway, here's a poem for her. She was in her 50s and she just died. She just out of the blue, just uh, died, we were not sure why, but it was a sudden illness and nobody expected it. And um, anyway, it's called Ode to Janice, 9 13 19. I had carried myself to the local caucuses, determined to cast for my candidate. And I met her, this tall, gracious stranger who connected me to the opponent who shared her convictions then he listened at a respectful distance while he gently convinced me to reconsider my vote. And four months later, after putting my ballot in the box for the general, she remembered me as I headed to my car. She called out to me, clearly, sonorously. She remembered me. She stopped me. And she invited me to the victory dinner for later that evening that her certainty had foreseen as a foregone conclusion. And when I passed through the dining room door, I regained acquaintance and met many whom I would know in many campaigns to come. She was happy to see me. She laughed joyously. We always greeted each other warmly after that. We never became social friends, but I always felt connected to something in her. I couldn't name, and then I read on Facebook, his spirit emblematic of healing the world, mending, and suddenly left without the breath to say goodbye. Death had stopped. And her inexplicable passing stopped me. She left her traces within me and inspired me to renew my interest in my locality and political possibilities and people and problems that matter to make the world saner one phone call at a time. Tomorrow, I'll be heading to headquarters to take my place at the table so others can find their place at theirs. She will listen from a respectful distance. And what she brought to this stranger, now mourning, and all those who felt her love, will pass as a ceaseless pulse to all who join our path.